WGAL News 8's Weather on the 8s with meteorologist Christine Ferreira. Good morning, it is 638. Yesterday's high was a record busting 66 degrees, so it comes as no surprise from the Climate Prediction Center here that our outlook for February in the Susquehanna Valley calls for above average temperatures. And that's going to be the case in the seven day forecast. Most days either at or above average. Here's our News 8 Storm Team forecast today. It's still going to be mild. I wouldn't rule out some 60s for our highs today. Here's the difference. It comes with clouds and it comes with some rain. So as you step out the door this morning, there's light rain around. Most of the area will see rain through about lunchtime with some showers trailing in thereafter. Tonight, a cold front starts to drop in from the north and that's going to change the game a bit temperature wise for tomorrow. So tonight, scattered showers with that front dropping in. Tomorrow, we don't get out of the 30s for highs, so temperatures will hold steady throughout the day in the mid to upper 30s. And there could be a little patchy drizzle after morning showers end. Here's a live look in York. Currently 44, that's warmer than our average high. Light rain falling with calm winds. It's 41 in Lebanon, 39 for Sealands Grove, but look at Lewistown at 55 degrees. The difference here is we have a bit of a breeze picking up, and that's mixing that warm air that's just above the surface right down to the surface in westernmost county. So just like yesterday, some spots will be warmer than others in the morning. Live here on Super Doppler 8, our satellite and radar combined showing overcast skies, light rain moving through, and there's still more moving through western PA. But all of this is along this stalled out front, this slow moving front, which will keep sending waves of low pressure our way and waves of precipitation each day. So let's time it out for you today. The light morning rain comes through kind of tapers around lunchtime, but there still could be a few additional light showers this afternoon. Tonight, watch this front. It sags south and that's going to bring in the colder air. So the 30s that are in New York today are going to be visiting us tomorrow. Tomorrow, look for some morning showers, a little spotty drizzle for the afternoon. As we head into Thursday, here's the problem in the forecast. We could have some freezing rain early before sunrise in most spots and then it changes over to rain. So if you're commuting early Thursday, that's something that we're going to be watching closely as far as temperatures are concerned for the potential for some early freezing rain. Otherwise, just plain old rain there as we go into Thursday afternoon. Here's a seven day forecast numbers up and down right next couple of days. Then we kind of stay steady in the 40s Friday through early next week. But each day there is an icon on that forecast with either some rain or snow showers or even a bit of a mix. So active pattern, uh, unsettled pattern, but bit dreary, dreary. <laughs> yes, but I still don't see any significant cold. So that means no all snow events, right? They're going to be kind of that mix on the front end or the back end. 